So here's a Hooke's Law question. <coughs> Excuse me. A Hooke's Law question from the practice exam. It's question um, 17. And the idea is, well, the, the intro says that the guy's building a, a backyard swing with a tire and a rope. So I've drawn a little diagram here. Now, he wants the bottom of the tire to be 50 centimetres off the ground. But he notices that when he attaches the tire, instead of being 50 centimetres, it's only 40 centimetres off the ground. And the tire weighs 2 kilograms. So he's had an extension of 10 centimetres, which is 0.1 metres. Now the mass is acting downwards, so the force of the weight is that acting downwards, sorry, so the force is the weight. Oops, sorry, that's not right. That shouldn't be that, that should be I'll just cross that out, that's KX, yeah. Now if we wanted the direction of the force, that opposes the extension, but we don't, we just want the constant. So we can rearrange, don't worry about the K being negative or positive, we rearrange it and we get... Well, F is just mg, isn't it? Yeah. And it's and the mass is 2, we'll take G to be 10, the extension is 0 0.1, 20 divided by 0 0.1, which is 200. Now the units of force are newtons, the units of extension of metres, so it's 200 newtons per metre. Cool. Yep. That's the answer.